In this video, we're gonna showcase a number of unique offerings from Milwaukee, specifically designed for automotive work. Now, Milwaukee's got a whole new range of mid-torque wrenches incoming to Australia right now, and this half-inch unit is one of them. This is the new M18 Fuel mid-torque impact wrench. It's lighter, more compact than its predecessor, but boasting a lot more power. And a really good triple work light up the business end, so no matter what attachment you are using, it won't cast a shadow on your work. It also features four modes you can cycle between, and it packs 881 newton meters of nut-busting torque, which is quite a wallet. And Milwaukee's got an ever-expanding range of lights to help you see what you're doing while you work. Many of their smaller lights have magnet mounts, which are great for working on cars. But one light that I really want to show you is the M12 LED underhood light. It features nice padded mounts that you can adjust for under the hood or under the car. It'll stay there securely and pump out 350 lumens of light from those TrueView high-definition LEDs. The M18 Fuel Extended Anvil Impact Wrench nicely walks that balance of high torque output with controlled delivery. Replacing pneumatic units which require hoses and compressors which get in the way, it also replaces the need for torque extension bars. It's got four speed modes, each with a customizable torque range that you can adjust via the One Key app on your phone to set it up to suit your workshop. And then just sit back and enjoy the torque. 1,016 newton meters of fastening torque, 1,491 newton meters of nut busting torque. There's a couple of polishers in the Milwaukee range as well for auto detailers. The M18 Fuel 180mm variable speed polisher and the M12 cordless variable speed polisher and sander. Now the M18 polisher features a 180mm pad with eight speed modes, ranging from 360 to 2200 RPM. And the brushless motor provides a constant speed. Combine that with the rubber grips, it gives you loads of control. It's a very nice polisher to use. While the M12 polisher sander has a pistol grip, a range of two to three inch sanding and polishing attachments, and two speed modes. Polishing mode goes from zip to 2800 RPM, while sanding mode goes all the way up to 8300 RPM. For impacting power but in tight spaces, check out the M12 Fuel right angle impact wrench. Again, a small compact wrench, but with increased reach, it also has four speed modes and up to 300 Newton meters of nut busting torque, which is really impressive. And when you don't need that colossal power of an impact wrench, but you're still working in a tight space and you want to reduce your elbow work, check out the M12 Fuel Extended Reach Ratchet. It's got loads of reach, 74 Newton meters of max torque, and that paddle switch gives you loads of control as well. It's a very nice bit of kit. The bread and butter of automotive work are your socket sets, and Milwaukee make a really nice range of sockets as well. The ratchets that come with them have just a four degree arc, which is perfect for tight spaces that's really tiny. They feature both metric and SAE sockets in a combination of deep well and standard design. I also love the sockets have a square form. It's really handy because they won't go walk about across your bench. There are sets suitable for quarter inch, three eighth inch and half inch drive. Make sure you check them out. Another great bit of M12 kit replacing the pneumatic equivalent is the M12 fuel straight die grinder. It's also available in an angled die grinder as well. The straight die grinder has three speed modes maxing out at 21,000 RPM, while the angle grinder has an extra speed mode and maxes out at 24,500 RPM. Really impressive. And never underestimate the M12 platform, the M12 stubby impact wrench in particular. For such a small, compact, and light wrench, it still boasts 339 Newton meters of nut fastening and fastening torque. Milwaukee's also got 15 and seven piece combination spanner sets. Now these spanners feature a 144 tooth ratchet up the ring end with only a two and a half degree arc, which is super tiny. They got max bite on the open end for a really nice grip. And just like the sockets, they got a beautiful finish and really clear, easy identifiable markings. And there's loads more automotive hand tools from Milwaukee, everything from priors to vice grips to C clamps. Adjustable spanners, hook and pick sets in storage. They've got some great trolleys and benches and don't forget their pack out. I've linked everything you can see here in the description below, but make sure you go check out the full range of sydneytools.com.au. And I would be amiss if I didn't give an honorable mention to the M12 soldering iron when working on a car, it really comes into its own. Whether inside or underneath, no cord makes it a no brainer. I featured it recently in our electrical range video from Milwaukee. Make sure you go check that one out as well. And if you want to get hands on or you want more information on any of these items in the Milwaukee automotive range, make sure you drop into your local Sydney Tools store. Hit me up with any questions in that comment section down below. And until next time, I'm Tim. Thanks for watching Sydney Tools TV.